So I see a lot of stuff out there on social media. People are asking, uh, what does it mean if my guy does this? What if it means if my girl does that? Or if they don't do something? And there's always these questions about how do I know? Because one of the biggest things that we have as humans is that we want to be loved. We want to know that we're loved. And we want to know that we're not being a fool, that we love somebody just as much as they love us. I was thinking water and love share some similar properties. Um, water is incompressible. What I mean by that, if you put water in a cup, you can't smash the water down in the cup so you can put more water in. Like it is what it is. And once you get to the top of that cup, if you keep pouring water into it, then it's going to overflow. That's just the nature of water. It's incompressible, uncompressible. I believe love's the same way. We say, we talk about our hearts, and uh, it's a good metaphor. I think it is. But we are a vessel of love. And, and love is not compressible. You can't put love in there and press it down so that you can put more love in. Love overflows. The more you love something, the more you love someone, the more obvious it is because it overflows. If you have a question on how somebody feels, just look at what they do. Look at their actions. Somebody can love you and treat you right, but they don't always express it. It's not in everything they do. You know that they don't love you overflowing. And if you love somebody to that overflowing mark and you feel you need somebody that loves you in the same way, you're going to have to go because you can't fake it. You can't add to it. Well, however their capacity is of love is, that's what they got. If you can tell yourself, I can love this person, even though they don't show me the affection that they need, then by all means, love them. They don't have to be perfect. Just know this, that if what you see coming out of that other person is them being mean, them being spiteful, hateful, abusive, if you've got a man that beats you, that's what's flowing out of his heart. And you might say, well, he was just this, he was just drunk, he was just mad, he was just... I'm telling you right now, lady, that's what flows out of his heart. Because it's incompressible. You can't smash that stuff down. And when it comes to the top, you're going to see what a person's made of. And this isn't a video about leaving because somebody's being abusive, but definitely leave because somebody's being abusive. But here's the thing that I had to realize here recently is, if I love somebody... And it wasn't overflowing. I wasn't doing the things I would normally do with somebody that I felt deeply in love with. I knew it just wasn't there and I had to leave. So for all of you out there that are questioning, does this person love me? Do I love that person? Is this, should this be happening in a relationship? Just think about that flow. You can't compress it. It's going to overflow and it's going to spill out. If... It's constantly being renewed. So take a look at your partner. And if that motherfucker's not overflowing for you, you know what you gotta do.